Hi guys, here's Professor Thiago, and in this video I will talk about entropy and entropy of mixing. I will show how can we derive an equation for delta S and for delta H, starting from the equation for delta G. If you are looking for physical chemistry videos in YouTube, I invite you to subscribe to the channel. Okay? So, in another video, it was shown the derivation of the equation for the free energy of mixing. Using the mixing of two ideal gases as a model, we reach the following equation, and we have discussed in details that delta G is always a negative number, is always negative. That is because ln xA and ln xB are negative numbers, okay? So we have a spontaneous mixing, okay, when we have two gases. As delta G equals delta H minus T delta S, it's useful to investigate the influence of entropy and entropy on the free energy of mixing, okay? Which parameter is more relevant for the spontaneity, okay? Okay, the entropy of mixing can be easily obtained using the following equation, which, we, which is a very important equation in thermodynamics. Del G del T at constant pressure equals minus S. This equation comes from the combination of first and second laws of thermodynamics. Okay? In other words, to obtain the entropy of mixing, one can simply derive the equation for the free energy of mixing in relation to T at constant P and multiply the result by minus 1. That is, we can take the equation above for delta G, derive it in relation to T, and multiply by minus 1. By doing so, we will have an equation for the delta S of mixing. Okay? Thus, the equation for delta S of mixing is this one is very similar to the equation of delta G, but we don't have the T anymore, okay? And we have a negative sign in front of it. And this negative sign is very important because, as I have said, ln xA and ln xB are negative. However, with this negative sign in front of the equation, delta S will be positive for every value of xA and xB, which means the entropy always increases when we have a mixture of two gases, okay? And this also applies in the liquid state, okay? As delta G equals delta H minus Ts, a positive entropy contributes to the spontaneity of the process, that means Delta S being positive makes delta G being negative, okay? The entropy of mixing can be obtained by simply replacing the equations for delta G of mixture and delta S in the general equation delta G equals delta H minus T delta S. By doing so, we will have an equation like this one, and we can make some rearrangement and reach this very important result. Delta H of mixing equals zero. If you recall for the definition of entropy, delta H for processes at constant pressure equals the heat. Okay? So if delta H equals zero, this means that there is no heat involved in the mixing in the mixing of ideal gases, okay? So, we reach this general conclusion that is very important for the thermodynamics of solutions. Delta G is always negative, okay? Doesn't matter the value of Xa. Delta S is always positive and delta H is zero. So, we can say that delta S is the parameter that makes delta G negative, okay? If you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a question or a comment, and follow us in the social media.
Thank you guys.